Hey, I'm a. I'm here for the pastor appreciation roast. How are you? Very much, yeah. Yeah. Uh, And uh, seeing as you got a good crowd here gathered, and you know I'm a used to be a pastor a long time ago, and I got a sermon ready. Mind if I uh, spend five minutes roast? I mean preaching. (laughs) All right. This will work out well. Well, my name's Herod Gentry. And uh, good to be here. And well, when I first thought of becoming a preacher, I didn't know if I had the intensity it requires. Would I be able to keep the congregation's attention? And could I tell a good joke to break the ice? Well, truth of the matter is, I can't. The only reason the congregation laughs is they're stuck here in the sanctuary. They got no place to go. They're in their pews and they're good Christian people, so they laugh just to make me feel better. Do you know what I mean? Oh, where was I at? Give me a second here. All right. Yeah, I know. It takes a lot of energy and enthusiasm and stuff. That's right. I found that God will give you the energy to preach and teach. When I grew up in Kentucky, did I tell you that yet? I grew up in Kentucky. And I love me some Kentucky. Can yucky, can lucky, can we stop talking about can yucky? Anyway, I grew up in Kentucky and I even pastored a church there. Can you guess how many members were there the first Sunday I spoke? Eight. 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 Amen. Eight. How do you know? It's like you've heard this before. Oh, where was I at here? Was... Oh, yeah. Energy and enthusiasm and stuff. I ain't got there yet. I used so much energy when I preached, I couldn't even gain weight. The truth of the matter is, I mean, I only weighed 100 pounds with my pockets full of bolts, nuts, and nails, and scrap steel and stuff. The weirdest thing happened back then one day. You wouldn't believe it. I stepped on the scale after I ate supper one day. And guess what? I had lost two pounds. (laughs) Do you think, do you know what I mean? No. Do do you think people felt sorry for me? No. Because nobody feels sorry for skinny people. (laughs) Who would feel sorry for people that can't gain a few pounds? Amen? No one feels sorry. Poor me. Well, the truth of the matter is, I was so skinny I couldn't find clothes that fit. So I'd have to shop at the Little and Skinny store. You know, we had those down there in Kenyucky. Little and Skinny store. Not big and tall, but Little and Skinny. Oh, yeah, speaking of clothes that fit, I had a son. His name was Jacob Jenry. And... I about went broke buying that boy clothes just to fit him in and shoes and clothes and stuff. I'm off topic again. I'm sorry. Where was I? Oh, yeah. Kentucky Wildcats. That's where I was at. Wildcats. Go Wildcats. Amen. Amen. Hush. This is God's country. This is Indiana. But I really do don't love cats. Have I ever told you that? I don't love cats. My wife does, but I don't. I've tried to get rid of that pesky animal. Now, don't tell my wife this. Now, don't tell my wife this. But when she goes on the women's retreats, I've tried to get rid of that horrible animal when she's out there at the lake house. I heard that if you only feed the cats onions, they will starve. Oh, yeah. Speaking of that... I found something that helped me keep me at my healthy level, my weight, with a strict diet of meatloaf for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, I could keep my physical body at its peak. Where was I at? Oh, yeah. The next plan of attack. That's right. Again, don't tell her if you see her. And we're on on Facebook Live, are we? We're on on Facebook Live or anything? I'm about to tell something. So t- turn to Facebook Live and YouTube Live. Okay. All right. So don't tell her. It's not like she sits in the front left pew of every service I preach. So, But the next time the ladies go on a trip, 
I got a three-step plan to kill the kitty. <laughs> Encounter, equip, exterminate. <laughs> well, my time is up. I already used my five minutes. I didn't even get to my sermon, but... Well, the truth of the matter is, I can't tell you. You all end up telling my wife anyway. <laughs> <laughs>